um, I stopped the video and uh, messed it up. Test the button and okay, but yeah. So yeah, I don't have enough space for my bags and everything. I got curtains in the closet. Um, I've been having some organized ideas. And I've been getting things like, um, like, uh, shoe organizers and stuff like that that I haven't opened yet, I haven't arranged any of this stuff yet, and I really haven't had the time, but hopefully I can get some of this stuff done today. Plus, I want to just, you know, all my floors in my house are um, white. Freaking hate that. But, um... It's been about a week since I mopped my bedroom floor, so I'm going to um, bleach and mop this and deodorize this and everything like that because I love for my area to smell fresh. And um, over here, I have four pictures on one. But one says, hope is all you need to make it happen. And I like inspirational um quotes so yeah I, and I like the color of this right here got that and then I have one that says do something creative every day and yeah I really like that one the next one is just a picture of some red um, flowers and then a mirror that I need to clean and I was thinking that maybe I could get some more mirrors to make my room look bigger um, I have a sand um, that always face me because I always need the air. <clears throat> Over here is just cluttered up. It's a, a nice sand. It has a lamp, um, my little puppy, um, some hand weights, um, my Bible, um, some wax. Um, like, you know, for my eyebrows or whatever. Um, some Akai Detox and Ginger Boa and Probiotics, you know, for women. I have a little jewelry box. Um, yeah, it's just a mess. And then, I have another table here next to my bed that has, like, you know, boxes that have, um, some of my favorite items in it. I have a... A little, um, one of those clear organizers. I think it's organized. And a lot of notebooks. You'll find notebooks all over my bedroom because, again, I'm in grad school and I'm always writing and I always buy a lot of notebooks. Um, have another laptop right there. Um, I'm forever buying a laptop. Um, and I have another. Um, picture that sits on my TV stand that um, pretty much is, you know, God grant me the serenity. I know you've all saw this um, prayer. And, um, yeah, and it's cold and black, and I really like it. Um, I actually have a DVD player that I bought from Best Buy, like, I mean, my room is just so unorganized. Like, here's my waist trainer, just sitting on top of the DVD player that I no longer use. It's a Sony. I bought it, watched one movie, and now ever since then, everything plays in black and white. I don't know what happened, but I'm really pissed off about it because I don't have the receipt, and I've only watched one movie on it. Over here, I have my little bookshelf stereo and speakers and more books mail combs my room is just really in need of some serious organization um i have two small closets in my bedroom which i'm not really gonna go in right now because um they are a mess and i mean look at look at my shelves look at the yeah yeah and there's a little thing that i bought for um some of my purses and Still haven't had a chance to hook that up yet. Um, I mean, it's just a mess. Like, I got these shadows in here that I had got for like shoes and stuff. And as y'all can see, everything else is on. And um, 
There's shelves in the back portion of my closet. It's just a mess, y'all. A mess. Like, I really got to get this room organized. And I guess that's what I'm going to be doing most of the day. And then um, I have a portable washer and dryer, which is not big enough to wash my comforters. Maybe my sheets, but not my comforters. So I'm going to have to go to the large mat and wash my comforters um, today. And yeah, so that's pretty much what my day is going to be consisted of. And if you guys have any ideas on like decorating tips or what I can do to decorate my room, because like I said, I have a big bed and small space. And I got to rearrange my space so I don't feel cluttered or closed in. And so that's what I'm going to do today. And maybe tomorrow I'll do a cooking video or exercise video or I don't know you guys. I want to get back into the swing of doing my videos during this time because I'm not really working that much right now. I plan on going on back to work like part time. I really don't want anything full time because of school and I'm you know I want to have the time that I need to focus on my classes in grad school. But um <clears throat> yeah. Um I, I first, you know, for me to focus, I got to get my space the way I want it. And I'm really like my headboard is like super big. So when I decide on how I'm going to do my room, and y'all see I got a lot of tools and stuff, um, I need to put my space in a way where it's, um, the bed is just not just, you know, just like in a spot where it's just not, where it's just taking up the whole room basically which my room is not that big I've never measured it before but I know just from looking at it that my room is not that big and so I have to do something with my space as far as organization so um but mainly like I said I want to get my bed from by the wall I didn't really want to block my windows over here I have two windows I got two windows right there but y'all can see but it's not too many spots I can put my bed in see right there I have two closets and then I got that little area right there where my entertainment is at and my headboard would basically cover that whole area if I was to put my bed that way so I can't put my bed that way and I don't know y'all I really don't know and if I put it in that direction which is probably what I'll end up doing putting my bed over there somewhere so um it's so I can get on both sides of my bed because that's my main thing right now I can't get on both sides of my bed and I want to be able to go on both sides of my bed so when I'm making my bed you know <coughs> excuse me and so I can stop my daughter's cat from running under my bed and us having to wait forever for it to come from up under my bed. Because last time um, it did that, um, they left a little something extra for me under the bed and that really pissed me off. So um, we had two cats, now we have one. Um, and that was my daughter's idea. She actually put my cat out and kept her cat. I wasn't really sure how I felt about that in the beginning. I was kind of pissed off because um, I was like, I was going to get rid of both of the cats. And um, But yeah, um, her cat just got one thing to do with that cat out of here. Like, I don't want them anymore. I don't want the cats because um, they scratch at your furniture. They run under your bed and do things that they shouldn't do. And, um, you know, I got a sensitive nose and stuff like that, and I don't want them. I don't want her cat, so eventually we're going to be getting rid of that cat. Um, I would prefer to just have, and my daughter, she just loves, loves, loves getting animals that she only keep for a little while before she gets tired of them. We don't have everything there is, and I don't want any more animals in my house because I, I just don't. I don't like the way cats smell, just... 
No, 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 no. If anything, it'll be like some fish or something like that. In a, maybe, you know, a bird if it's a quiet bird or something. I don't know, but I just know I don't want any more cats, dogs, uh, stuff like that. I don't want no more of that. And so, right now, I just got to focus on getting my space the way I want it today. And um, I got to set some ground rules. For my oldest daughter out there and my other daughter because they do things that they shouldn't do. Well, mainly like, um, you know, they both do things that they shouldn't do. Like my oldest daughter, she tends to wash all week long and that just raises up my light bill and that's going to have to stop. Then my youngest daughter, she has a habit of leaving dishes in her room or coming home from school and running straight out the house, which I told her today, that's not going to happen because you got to come home, you got to do your homework, you got to do your chores. And then, if you want to go out, you can. But you're going to have to get back here before it gets dark or before it gets too late because it's a school night and you don't need to be out um, and about like that anyway. Whether you're at your friend's house or whatever, um, your friend going to have to come over here or whatever. you know. But I think that's kind of what my daughter does just to get away from doing some of the things that she needs to be doing. And um, during the course when I was working seven days a week, they was able to do things like that. And, um, you know, more so because they knew I wasn't here and stuff like that. But now I'm here. So, um, it's about to get, about to get a little, you know, in here. So, yeah, y'all, I'm about to let y'all go because this video is almost 12 minutes long. And I just wanted to, um, let y'all know that I'm going to be organizing the day. And when I get this situated, I'm going to come back in and, <laughs> with another video and show y'all what happened and what I end up doing. All right. Anybody got any ideas for small rooms with big beds and, you know, organizing ideas or how I should rearrange my room? Uh, let me know. All right. Bye.